Hey, just a reminder, we're having our first company meeting in a bit. Don't be late. Company meeting? Nice euphemism. I'll be right there. I don't know, guys. What do you think? I feel like there's a lot we're missing. There is, but it's enough to go on for now. What about criminals? Don't we kind of need more than three if we want to call this thing an empire? There's four of us. Oh, are you planning on shooting anyone? After that party, I think I'll stick to metaphorical blood on my hands. Yeah, that's less useful when people try to kill us. Nina's right. We need more people. We'll look more legit if we have a home base. You saying we're not legit already? Oh, I love you, but I'm allergic. <clears throat> yeah, point taken. All right, let's brainstorm. What would our place need? I gotta be able to host some parties and have more than a fucking galley kitchen to work with. I wanna be able to set up a proper garage to work in. I don't think Sergio's gonna be letting me near the forge anytime soon. That's good. What you got? I don't know, a ball pit? I'm joking. Kind of, I'm kind of joking. It needs to be defensible. We pissed off a lot of people, and let's not kid ourselves, they're gonna try to kill us. You're fun. Hey man, just being real. For me, we need it to be cheap. We don't have a lot of cash, so... We'll probably be looking at a fixer-upper. So, we need an open space for the interior, a decent plot of land to build a garage, it's gotta hold up in a firefight, and it's gotta be dirt cheap. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be a bitch fine. I got it! Holy shit, we are so good at this. There's an old church. Near Fort Cullen. The sanctuary is huge. I can turn the rectory into a garage. It's condemned, so it's cheap. And it's got a fucking graveyard, so we can stash the bodies. You fucking rock. What are we waiting for? Let's check this place out. Let's go. I'll drive. Where is this church? Up on 3rd. Oh, that place. Guys, look at these pictures. The architectural details look amazing. Let me see. Lena, this place is in ruins. I said it was a fixer-upper. 
There's a fine line between Fixer Upper and Money Pit. Relax. The listing says it's being restored by a developer, John Bland. John Bland? The real estate king of Santo Eliso? Is he the guy on all those billboards? Why does a guy that into self-promotion stick with a name like Bland? Bland is no Roger McGillicott, but he does restore the place, and we can still get it for cheap. It might work out. Assuming the restorations preserve the original facade. You're not gonna worry about preservation when I put in my state-of-the-art kitchen, are you? We can discuss that later. That's a lot of heavy equipment for a renovation. Looks more like a demolition crew. He's gonna restore this place in the condos. Not if we do something about it. A request has come in via our social media from Zebra Crossing, asking for anything composed by Otto Nikolai. I have to say my personal favorite of Nikolai's compositions is the Merry Wives Tell of Tell your Wednesday. who wants to yeah, demo a demo crew. Play. So up next, an excerpt from The Merry Wives. Get out of here. Move this for ya. drive one of these. Much for that demolition crew. Attention! This property is protected by Marshall Defense Industries. Park the bulldozer and come out with your hands up! What the fuck are these Marshall rent cops doing here? Shit. Bland must contract with them for security. Oh, fun. Hang tight. I'll take care of them. Be with that. Oh. 
That's the last of them. Damn. Sounds like the drivetrain overheated. Guess it wasn't designed with you in mind. Marshall's down, but they'll be back as long as Bland owns the deed to the property. Then let's get in to sell. After this? Not likely. It'll shake him down and make him hand it over. The idols used to do stuff like that all the time. Good call. Kev, you're with me. Where's Bland even at? Let's call the number on all those billboards and find out. Bland here. One sec. Mr. Mayor, been an honor talking to you. Sounds like he's at City Hall. All right, who's this? Mr. Bland, I'm calling to take that old mission church off your hands. Huh? Wait, are you the asshole who just wrecked my demolition site? Listen, fuck nut, you set foot on one of my properties again, I'll make sure you can't buy so much as a tool shed in this town. Well, that was uncalled for. Eh, let's go take his ass for a little ride. Hey, hey, is that him in that car? Same dickish face as the billboards. I'm commandeering your vehicle. Hi there, me again. You gonna make this easy and give me the deed to the church? You go fuck yourself. Bad answer, John. Hope you don't get carsick. Let's show this shitbag a little Santo Eliso drift. What are you doing? What are you doing? Speed up. Jesus, stop the fucking car. We are. Now give us the D. No way! Okay, guess we're gonna have to play hardball. I told you to play hardball in traffic. Speed up. Don't want him jumping out. Give us the deed. No! Guess the ride's not over yet. Final offer, John. You're not leaving here unless we get what we want. Think you can handle a little airtime? That was Night Driver by Infrared. Holy fuck! Don't slow down. 
Dude might try to jump out. Fine. Take the deed. Take my whole damn briefcase. Just leave me alone. Pleasure doing business with you. This car is also ours now, too, so get the fuck out. Great! We got the deed and the briefcase. Yeah, plus we blew up some shit, did some sick drifts, and uh, stole the church. All in a day's work. Ready to head home? Home? I like the sound of that. Ooh, I'm gonna post about it. Yada yada da, yada da da da. Hashtag take me to church, hashtag new digs who this, hashtag this. And post it. Oh, look! I already got a like. Seriously? How many followers do you have there? DJ Kev has his fans. Marshall backed off. You get the deed? Yep, we got the dude's whole briefcase. Let's get inside. You got the keys? Keys? No, just the briefcase. No problem. I'm sure I can get in through a window or something and open it up. Why don't we just break down a door? Uh, not my door. Whoa, calm down, Dad. Do you know how much a door costs? We own this place. We have to pay for that shit.
Nina was right. This place is awesome. Hey, check it out! Cool graveyard! Yeah! Hang on, I'm getting a call! Oh, shit. You better hear this. Hi, Kevy. We saw your post. Congrats on the new dicks. We adore your takedown of that gentrifying dick. Who is that? The Collective. The Idols want to throw you a housewarming party. Fuck. Their parties get violent. No thanks. I wasn't asking. Duh. <laughs> See you soon, Kevin. Uh... I'll get the door. Hang tight. We've got company coming. Have you seen what's in this briefcase? Not now, Eli. Get inside. And maybe revisit your stance on guns. <laughs> I can't wait to deface that facade! You've got a pair on you. some backup in the graveyard. I'm coming, Kev. We've got company coming. Have you seen what's in this briefcase? Not now, Eli. Get inside. And maybe revisit your stance on guns. <laughs> yeah, not too easy. You can't own land. It belongs to everyone. You won't hit me with that. A hero. I don't think so, shitbag. I can use some backup in the graveyard. I'm coming, Kev.
church. Help! I've got you, Eli. Fight like the collective's watching! I can fight with my hands! It's cute sometimes. Me your prayer. I'm not gonna feel bad about killing you. Still got it. Hell of a housewarming. Guess all that's left to do is check out the new digs. Yeah, okay. Dead bodies notwithstanding, this place is pretty great. Right? There's a lot of potential here. A lot of work to do, but still... We're actually gonna do this, aren't we? You're goddamn right we are. At least we've got a cool logo. I'll take it off the whiteboard. We need a name. The Saints. We call ourselves the Saints. 